So a lot of comments about Valorant stuttering. In this video, I'll show you some common solutions that worked for me when I was using my older setup. Hopefully these will work for you too. Without wasting any more time, let's get straight into this tutorial guide. But before we start, let me say there's a good chance this could be bad dev side optimization. You know, Riot sucks a lot sometimes. Still, if you're facing issues after trying these fixes, let me know in the comments. There are more steps we can explore. This tutorial focuses on fixing low memory and GPU related latency issues, which might solve your problem. First, we will use virtual memory. If you're using eight gigabytes of RAM or below, this method is helpful in most cases. Just make sure you have an SSD or NVMe to gain the proper benefits from it. To open the virtual memory settings, press Windows plus S, type advanced system settings and open it. Under the advanced tab, go to performance settings and click on it. In the performance options window, go to the advanced tab and click the change button under virtual memory. Uncheck automatically manage paging file size for all drives. Choose your C drive or any faster drive partition. Make sure that drive has at least 10 gigabytes or more of free storage. Now, the formula is pretty simple. This information needs to be in megabytes. Convert your RAM size into megabytes and multiply it by three for the maximum size of the paging file. In the initial size field, use the recommended size shown there. For the maximum size, multiply your installed RAM size by three. For example, if you have 16 gigabytes of RAM, first convert it into megabytes. 16 gigabytes times 1024 equals 16,380 megabytes. Then multiply that by three to get 49,152 megabytes. Once you've entered those values, click set and then click OK. Next, let's address an issue that's helpful even for people stuck in queues while loading Valorant. If you or your friends face queue stuck issues, this method is also useful. When you play games on a PC, they generate a shader cache that gets stored on your system. By default, this handles fine, but this is Riot we're talking about, right? You get my point. Open your NVIDIA control panel and find Manage 3D settings. On the right side, scroll down to find Shader Cache Size. Set this to 10 gigabytes or more, but make sure you have enough free space plus an extra 10 gigabytes for your system to breathe. For me, I sometimes set it to 10 gigabytes whenever I feel Valorant stuttering. When I play other games, I set it back to default. There's no harm in switching between these settings, it's all about optimization. A good optimized game runs smoothly even on default settings, but for poorly optimized games like this one, tweaking these settings can make a big difference. That's it guys. Let me know in the comments if this helps fix your stuttering issues. I might not respond to every comment, but I read them all and do my best to address the important ones. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more guides like this. Thanks for watching. Signing off.